beautiful people everywhere out there this creative earth and today i'm going to show you how i did this cute high puff style so stay tuned now this style is especially easy although it can seem challenging but the first thing you want to do is saturate your hair with water and it can get messy so you may need a towel I'm also going to be spraying it with all oil and my my spray mix. It, it's just got everything in it. And that helps to soften my hair. Next, I'm going to separate my hair in the crown of my head or the middle to make a ponytail in the middle. Now, this is really important if you have high density hair. This is a really easy way to do a really good high puff because instead of trying to take all of your hair from all of it or even if you split it in half and just do half and half it can be a lot harder than just getting the middle into a ponytail that didn't really hurt I know it looked like it did but it didn't <laughs> And it doesn't matter how perfect the ponytail is because ultimately that's not the ponytail. It's more so just getting that um, pushed away so you don't have to hold all of your hair at once. Now I'm going to smooth all around the edges. So I've smoothed my edges and I have used gel. I will put the products I use in the description. I'm taking a ribbon and I'm pulling as I slide up. So I slide up and then pull. And then once I get most most of it up, I just kind of ride it up until it gets to the top. And the reason I can do that with ribbon is because it's satin, it's a satin ribbon and it's not really going to hurt my hair as much if I were to use like a shoestring or some other cotton type of material. So I can be a little bit more rough with this than I can with another material. So your high puff should be just as smooth as this is. Don't mind that little blank edge that is a chemical burn that I'm working on this year so don't worry about that if you have something like that then you know you have to smooth your edges down which is what I'm getting ready to do now now once I've done all that and my puff is in place I can take out that middle piece and then I have my full And now all you have to do is pull up any hair that you know you may want for more volume, pick it out, do whatever you want to do, but that is pretty much it. So there you have it. This style took me under about 10 minutes to do. Uh, I'm not going to lie because my hair is high density so it took a little bit longer than most people. But anyway if you like this style um, yeah I got my edges laid down. That took a little while. I think that took longer than anything else was to make my edges look perfect. Some perfectionist on that. And I still didn't do it right. Anyway, if you like this, subscribe. You know what to do. Like, comment, and keep watching. Bye-bye.